Hello everybody, this is Sierra Like and welcome to another episode of my Let's Play of Alan Wake. And let's try to kill this ball now. I think the thing I have to do is to like hide here or something. Aren't you going to try to kill me or something? Oh you are, huh? Nice. I'm right here. Want to try it again? Hells yeah, you want to. Then I just hide behind here and hope that he won't hit me. No, he won't hit me. Fuck you then! Ha! There we go. Fuck you then! Car! I'm here! Ha! <laughs> First try this time! Give me a fucking flashlight, please. Car, but the gate's locked. You're gonna have to go through the hedge maze over there! Ah, oh, fuck. Barry, I don't have a light. Take this, Al! Ah. Uh, Hells yeah. But if I take yours, oh, you will. Oh, God! Look at the house, Al! Look out! Oh, fuck. Oh shit! Oh fuck! Not torch! Oh shit, there are more! Oh fuck, yeah I'm dead. Mm, that was a bad spot to like, stand. But the gate's locked. You're gonna have to go through the hedge maze over there. I could just Barry, jump over here. Take this, Al. Thank you. Oh God! Look at the house, Al. Look now um what's going on here shit ah oh, right there we go is there more I don't think so Fuck is that? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Relax now. Ah, oh, shit. Now I told you enough times that I hate maces. Shit. Oh. Whoa! Shit, how the hell did I do from here? Ah, oh, you were probably in here. Ah, uh, batteries. Nice. Oh. Okay, maces. The thing about them, I don't like them at all. Don't trust e Emil. Uh, that's actually a boy's uh, name in Norwegian. It's called Emil. But, uh, yeah. Oh, Hartman followed the fall of Alan Wake with his binoculars. When the rider hit the water, he ordered Jack to take the boat to him. The spot was easy to see in the dark, even with all the extra lights in the boat. The flare floated and kept burning even in the water. Jack turned the radio louder as the engine sputtered. The music was rough and clanking. Something the Anderson brothers would no doubt have enjoyed. But Hartman chose to ignore it. Wake was finally within his reach. Okay. 
I stared at the Viking paraphernalia that littered the area, surrounding an unlikely centerpiece. A full-size stage complete with an impressive sound system with all the trimmings, including a dragon. It took a special kind of crazy to build something like this in a remote field. When the sky split open with a deafening boom and the music started blasting, it felt strangely appropriate. Okay. There's some batteries and I'm over here. This actually is pretty scary. No, don't do that. Where are you? Well, fuck you guys, fuck you right up the ass. Whoa, why don't you care about the light? If you kill you fast then. There was on the one, yeah. Uh is this the way to go? Ah, oh, the manuscript. Hartman hurried down the corridor. He had disliked leaving Wake when he was surely at his most susceptible to therapy. But this was not an ordinary storm. Wake had been riding, and he had woken something up in the depths of the lake. Now, it was coming for him. Hartman had naturally prepared for a situation like this. The idiot brothers would keep Wake distracted while Hartman double-checked everything, just to be sure. Okay. <laughs> By far the most scariest part in this game. The labyrinth or maze. Hello. Okay, that's also a little bit scary. Hello. Oh, hey! Hello. Time to die, asshole. Shit. There's a lot of birds here. I don't like the birds. How many do you have of those now? Whoa, fuck you birds! Die birds. Whoa! Get away from me! Shit, 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 shit. They're coming to get me. <laughs> Birds are by far the most threatening things in this game. I don't think, I don't know if I like that. <laughs> 
Mott knew that Wake was smarter than him. Wake had more money, a beautiful wife, everything. Okay. And Hartman said Wake was important. That made him better than Mott. But Mott was calling the shots now. He'd expected what the hell is Mott? In Gravel, but instead, he seemed willing to fight. Mott knew he'd gotten under Wake's skin. If only Mott actually had his wife. The thought made him shiver. Ah, uh, that's probably his... Or... My wife's kidnapper. Well, would the light like kill them or something? Whoa! Shit! Stop it! Crazy birds! Crazy ass bird, stop it! What now? Whoa, 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 whoa. Fuck you guys. For the moment. Barry was just glad he had survived the fall. He had been separated from Al, and there was no easy way to climb back up. He told himself he'd be okay. 